Searching for a gift idea? Well, we have one that'll spread some cheer all year round. Here to explain is PR and Community Outreach Manager for America First Credit Union, Nicole Cypers, along with December's Give Back winner, Julia Lazarick from The Hidden Sentence. Congrats, Julia, we're Thank so you. proud of you. Thank you so much. Yeah, we're gonna celebrate you and what you do in just a moment. Nicole, first, let's talk about the opportunity that people have right now to actually give the gift of membership during the holidays. Yes, so we're running a promotion right now for youth accounts, and it's a good opportunity for, maybe if you're struggling to have come up with a good gift idea for you know, younger people, um, children that maybe like, what do I buy them? They have everything they need. Oh yeah. Um, it's an opportunity maybe for you to go into the credit union and open up an account for them. We will match up to $25. So if you make a deposit of $25 initial into that account, we will match that. So they'll have $50 Great. in that account. If you are, have somebody who's already a member of the credit union and has an account, if you go in and make a $25 donation into their account um, or their gift into that account, um, we will enter them into a drawing and we're giving mm. away $250 dedicated savings accounts. Wow. So it's an opportunity maybe for them to get some additional money. So. Absolutely. And it's a way to, you know, start having that conversation early um, mm -hmm. about saving and finances and financial education for children. Oh, you don't have to sell me on that. I think it's super, super smart. Honestly, I mean, the, the sooner you can educate kids and you say, hey, you get a bike, but you also get a savings account. And guess what? Yes. You got to learn. You got to learn how to to be responsible well, for Well, and it. teaching so kids to budget their money and to, you know, to mm -hmm. save and to pay mm -hmm. themselves. And, you know, that's what I tell my kids, pay yourself. And when, what I mean yeah. by that is save, put it into your savings account and put that away for a rainy day or if something that they're they have their eye on that they want. But it teaches them the concept of putting something aside and having an nest egg. It is super smart indeed. All right. Well, Julia, welcome to the show. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. It's such a pleasure to be here. Thank you. Thank Absolutely. You. And you were nominated because you're doing some great work with The Hidden Sentence. Tell us all about the organization and what you do. Right. Prison The Hidden Sentence supports the outcarcerated. And what does that mean? Those are the people on the outside, the families, the friends, the children who are serving the sentence with their loved one that's incarcerated. Mm -hmm. And so the, their loved one is incarcerated on the inside, but they're not alone. So it affects mm. the whole community. So how do we support people on the outside? We do that by providing them information. And we also tell stories. We're raising awareness one story at a time so that people that have the unfortunate circumstance of having to visit their loved one. It's an emotional as well as a financial burden, and people don't realize that. Mm. I mean, one in 12 people know somebody or is affected by having a loved one incarcerated. In this studio, there's probably people mm. walking around that don't talk about it, and that's why we call it the hidden sentence. Nobody should have to serve the sentence alone, so we want to provide support and information to everybody so that they have what they need so that they can traverse the system and get the support that they need. Good for you. What moved you to start this organization? My brother was incarcerated, and during that time I didn't tell anybody, and I just recently started oh. talking about it, and I realized that so many people that I know were going through the same thing, or people that I've known for 10, 15 years didn't talk about it. So I'd like to remove the stigmatism. Mm. I'd like to eradicate the hidden sentence so that everybody can talk about it, that children can go to school and not be bullied and made fun of. And, and we have a local organization too, FIP, and that provides support to local communities. Mm -hmm. And it also uh, has a workshop for children of incarcerated parents to provide them emotional support and setting boundaries. And then on December 15th, we're doing a holiday party, and it's free to families that we do every year that we support, and it's for the children, and Santa comes and everybody gets a gift, and it's a great opportunity for families and children to get together in a safe environment. Great, Julia. We want to celebrate you and all the work you're doing with Thank The Hidden you. Sentence. Nicole, would you like to do the honors? Yes. So we have a check for you today, Julia, for $500. Thank you so much. We want to present this to you and congratulate you for all the work that you're doing and um, the difference that you're making in the lives of these individuals and for the courage that you have to you know, make this um, a topic that's not taboo to talk about. So thank you so much. That's the goal. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, good work. All right. If you <laughs> would like to nominate somebody for the Give Back Award, it's very simple. Just visit LasVegasMorningBlend.com and click on the Give Back. A lucky winner is chosen every month. America First Credit Union has 14 locations throughout Southern Nevada. And for more on them, you can visit the website on your screen. They are proud sponsors of the Morning Blend, and they are also on social.